we are back in Frederick, Wisconsin today. My allergies uh, at the end of August, which is when I'm filming this, is the absolute worst for me. So I'm sorry if I sound really nasally. It is really congested up here. And I wore a hat to distract my puffy eye look. But anyway, we're going to be going, uh, taking a tour of this long house. This is a 1,200 square foot, two bedroom, two bath, beautiful cabin. And we are back at Nordloos, which is a 140 acre property featuring meadows, trails, and a huge pond that is basically a lake. It is so large to me. And this is all of yours to explore. If you remember last year's video at the Metal Arc Tower, this place is truly, truly incredible. And I voted it, and I think I voted it my number one stay of last year. So this is a incredible spot. Check out that video whenever you're done with watching this one. Anyway, pull up on the property, drive down the expansive driveway past all of the wildlife, and you'll look for your signs, the longhouse. You'll pull up, and this is your Airbnb. Plenty of parking. We're perched up on the ridge, and we can overlook the pond from this property, which is really cool. The Douglas fir and the oxidized metal all on the side it makes this place look incredible and really really unique this place is also solar powered you can see the solar panels over here in the field uh, whenever it can be with the sun and I love that aspect as well but the first thing you walk into is the walkway that leads to the front door beautiful decked out walkway it looks incredible it kind of feels like you're walking over a riverbed or something with all the rocks underneath it and then your front door you can take a sharp left though and the walkway continues along the entire side and onto this other building and this is your outdoor patio space this space is some of the guests favorite spots I've heard because of how comfy it is in here with all of these chairs how big it is and you're just surrounded by the really quiet and peaceful nature now if you're not a fan of bugs or things like that you can lower all of the screens on these openings the door has one and these two huge openings also have one by a press of a button they'll automatically come down and you are totally secure in here from any bugs and the overall Overall design of this patio pairs well with the longhouse. So let's walk back into the front door and check out the interior space of this Airbnb. Whenever you first walk in, this is your foyer space. There are floor to ceiling windows right off the bat in here. And if we take a quick look in the living room and kitchen area, the floor to ceiling windows take up this entire wall for expansive views of the pond in the wilderness. One guest saw that there is a deer sleeping literally right in front of the window right here. So who knows what you might see whenever you come and stay here. But this foyer area, you can either take a left and walk all the way down this hallway or go down to the living room space, which we will take a left and check out this portion first you walk down the hallway this is wide enough for a wheelchair which is nice and then there's closet space with a washer and dryer here and then back here is your king-size bedroom with your bathroom that pairs with it the bedroom has the king-size bed right here in the middle beautiful Douglas fir cladding right behind it and the windows in this corner are incredible they lend in a great natural light and the views you can have uh, from sleeping in here is awesome then you have a fireplace right here in front of you for those cozy cold nights with your TV. If you want to watch some moving bed with the fireplace, it would be really cool. And there's a small desk right next to that, which is handy to have. And if we walk out of that, the bathroom was right before this, and this is a huge bathroom space. This bathroom is ADA compliant, which is nice, so a wheelchair can get in here and use it as well. Uh, the double bathroom vanity on this side is really beautiful. The tiled flooring and the tiled shower, which is right behind all of this, is beautiful. There is no lip between the floor and the shower, and the shower space is huge. There's jets everywhere. There is a waterfall shower head above you, and there's also handrails in here along with around the toilet, and the toilet is right here on the right side. So this is your first bathroom space, and we can exit out of that actually go all the way back around to the main living space you walk down these two steps there are ramps if you need them to get down these couple steps for the wheelchair and then there's your living room space open floor beautiful wood flooring and the huge windows all the way around this are just incredible the furniture design in here is also top-notch you got a black leather couch right here with a black leather chair to pair with it a couple other chairs up against these windows the coffee table in the middle you even have a fireplace up against this window and a TV and a piano that they include I've never been to an Airbnb where they include a piano for you to play which is really nice so piano players this place is for you <laughs> 
I cannot play, sadly. But anyway, beautiful living room. I love it a lot. Behind all of this is your kitchen space. This is a great kitchen to cook some meals at. And what do you need to cook meals? Well, you need a really high quality knife set. Which, thanks to today's sponsor for this video, we got one. And today's sponsor is Kamikoto Knives. If we do a quick unboxing, here's the box that comes in. Beautiful edges on the side of the box, and it's huge. Open it up through the latch, and inside it comes with a certificate of authenticity, and then the knives. The knives are made with high quality Japanese steel using traditional techniques that date back to 800 years ago. Each knife is individually inspected and comes with a lifetime guarantee. And these knives are used by Michelin star chefs all over the world. Kamikoto has several offers going on right now, and they're also offering you guys, my viewers, an additional $50 off of any purchase if you use my code Levi Kelly. Get yourself a knife set. They're really nice Japanese steel. I love them. Link is down in the description, and back to the tour. You have the huge island right here in the middle with these wooden bar seats that line it. Even a lower area over here for a dining space, which is incredible to be able to sit here right next to these windows overlooking the pond. I know I'm gonna mention that a lot in this video because I loved it anyway. The rest of the kitchen is up on this back wall with your refrigerator and then the rest of your countertop with your sink and your coffee maker over here. There's cabinets up above that hold a lot of your dishes and then there's even cabinets below with a dishwasher and just everything you need here. The Douglas fir cabinets look incredible over here and then there's even some on this side underneath the island. So this is a full specked out kitchen and even on top of the island they leave a lot of goodies here for you. Marshmallows, oat cereal, pancake mix, pancake syrup, coffee, Nordlous coffee specific, and some honey and tea. And I used most of it actually because it all tastes so good. So anyway, this is the kitchen and living room space. Really open, the wood Douglas fir cladding on this back wall also looks really well. So we'll walk back through the rest of the space. Through this back door is your other bedroom. There is a closet right here with some games and such. And then you walk into your private bedroom space. There is a closet right when you walk in and then the bedroom. There is a queen bed in here very similar layout to the last bedroom with the Douglas fir cladding behind it and then all of the windows in here that lets you look out onto the pond. Floor to ceiling windows, there's a fireplace in this corner and then the bathroom is actually tied onto the bedroom in here. You can walk through this door. If you notice that the ceilings are really tall that the top portion is glass which looks really cool and even in the bathroom it is the same way and there is a button that you can open up the glass doors up above the shower head. If you're taking a shower in here which is really handy and then the bathroom itself the vanity over here on the left and then your toilet behind it and then walk-in tiled shower with the jets and the same waterfall shower head uh, this is just a luxurious bathroom now we'll explore the rest of the property the host took me in his land rover and took me a little tour around all the trails which is really fun really cool land rover trails everywhere there's bridges on the property and meadows and rocks everywhere you drove me around the pond which you walk all the way down to the pond dock there's kayaks here you can use or a paddle boat which is really awesome if you remember last year saman and i got on this paddle boat and explored the entire pond there's lily pads everywhere swans live here i see them all the time and this is just the perfect spot for a getaway or just a couple's getaway or something like that very very romantic also there's the sunset prairie trail where you're looking over this beautiful meadow of flowers and this is where the sun sets very beautiful right next to that is the snow tubing hill for whenever it snows here there is a specific tubing hill that you have right here very cool this place has it all the property there's so much here I could mention but uh, you'll just have to come here and check it out all yourself. So this place is really cool. So if you like this, the link is down in the description to book this place. The dates go by so quick. I think uh, the next available dates are March or February or something. So if you want to come here, definitely check out the dates for next summer, which is a great time to be here because uh, they'll, they'll definitely go quick. So thank you for the host for having me. They're very kind. And thank you guys for watching these videos from work for you guys. These videos would not be able to happen. So I truly, truly thank you. Anyway, I'll see you guys in next week in another Airbnb tour.